Good morning, Kevin Leeds Harmonica here again. Um, I've been thinking about shuffles this morning. I say this morning. <laughs> I've been thinking about shuffles pretty much non-stop for the past 15 years um, or more. But that's what we do as harmonica players, right? There's something about the shuffle groove that's just so elementally bluesy and screams for some harmonica playing over it. Um, but that, that rhythm has been in blues since, since the beginning, you know, since, since dust was invented. Um, the reason I'm thinking about shuffles is because I hatched an idea for something that may or may not happen. Um, but it's amazing how much variety, how many varieties of shuffle there are, all with different feels, all which lead to a different uh, flavour of playing um, and it's usually carried on the drums you know you got that on the uh, hi-hat or whatever and the, uh, the snare and the kick on the back beads um, but really any any instrument can do it um, you know you got your bass going boom do dum do dum do dum do dum um, and it's all just that shuffle rhythm. It's really just baked into blues. And um, apart from maybe a slow blues, uh, uh, I would imagine that if you said blues to anyone, and in fact, if you went into a bar and there was a blues band playing, chances are 75% plus that it's going to be a shuffle. Most of the stuff that I've recorded for this series so far has been shuffles. Um, it's just such a massive part of blues, and it's so much fun to play harmonica over. Because it lends itself to all those chunky um, tongue blocking techniques, which we enjoy playing. I mean, I just love them. <laughs> I just, it's like um, I sometimes tell people I'm working with to think about the rhythm of a shuffle as if it's just always going on somewhere in the in the ether right and you just jump on it for a short while and then you jump off again which is a bit of a hippie-ish way of thinking about it but um it's useful for getting it under your skin and sort of feeling it you know um whenever i, I don't do this as much as i used to but uh right back early on when i was learning i just used to have that in my head all the time when i was you know walking up and down stairs when I was having a shower, it's just ching, 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 ching. it just rattles in my head all the time. You know, you'd be sitting at traffic lights going bump da bump da bump. I remember sitting on a bus, just tapping my foot and counting in my head through the very gently tapping my foot on the on the bus and just counting through twelve bars with that sort of shuffle feel. Um I don't know man, shuffles. They're they're elemental. They're they're important. Um and I came up with this lick. It sounds like one I've heard before. It sounds a little bit Kim Wilson-y, but I honestly can't remember where it came from or or, or quite uh, who I've pillaged it from. But I um, uh, hope you enjoy anyway. Okay, so A harmonica, second position. Here's the lick. <laughs> Quite simple, uh, dip on the three bend, straight to the five draw with a the flutter. Then it's big slap on the five draw, big slap on the five blow. And then we're doing a pull, a blow pull, and another five blow. And finishing up on the four draw. Very straightforward. Um, it feels to me like something that's going to be quite fun to mess about with. So um, let's just see how this goes. I've got a jam track in E linked in the description, obviously. Here we go. Thank you. 
<laughs> I was going for something there, I didn't quite get it. Let's try again. Not that one. Last one. Some days it works better than others, um, but that's a good, it's a good shuttle lick. All right, I'll see you next time. <laughs>